AMM is Allen & Heath's automatic mic mixer. There are up to eight individual AMM engines available in AHM64, four in AHM32, allowing separate automatic mic mixing for multiple locations at the same time and covering all input channels simultaneously. AHM16 has a single AHM engine. To assign an input channel to AMM, click on the AMM button on the input channels page. Select the number of AMM engines you will need and the mode you would like to use. Open the first AMM and click Set Assigned Inputs and patch the required channels. There are two operating modes in AHM, D-Classic and NOM or Number of Microphones. D-Classic uses a constant gain sharing algorithm to dynamically adjust the gain based on its input level. Louder signals receive more gain in the mix and quieter signals are still present but much quieter, maintaining smooth transitions and overall ambience. For each channel you can set a priority level which will offset the amount of gain going into the mix calculation and therefore give a higher or lower artificial gain to that channel. This is a variable slider with a range from minus 15 dB for low priority to plus 15 dB for high priority at the top. NOM or number of microphones mode acts as a gate, turning an input on when a threshold is passed. The level adjustment for each open input is equal and depends on the number of microphones open and the NOM attenuation parameter, which sets the amount of attenuation applied for every doubling of open microphones. You do not need to set the open mic threshold. NOM mode senses the background ambient noise level and automatically adjusts the open threshold, regardless of background noise. Off attenuation sets the amount of shutoff for closed mics. On hold time sets the amount of time an open mic is held open once the trigger is removed. You can set a channel as chair to give it higher priority over the other channels. For example, to let a chairman override another speaker. Chair sensitivity sets the sensitivity of signal required to trigger a chair mic open and therefore duck the other mics where 1 is the least and 10 is the most sensitive. Chair duck level sets the amount of attenuation applied to other mics when a chair mic is open. The best mic option ensures that only the mic receiving the strongest signal is activated. This can prevent crosstalk, phasing and ambience issues when multiple mics are triggered by the same voice. It is recommended that best mic is only used if all the mics are the same, with similar positioning and gain, like multiple mics across a tabletop, for example. 